Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we are going to be reviewing a product designated for nails. Um, I looked online actually and found the KISS 15 piece rechargeable nail file. Um, and I thought I would just give that a whirl, see how it works, and test it out on camera. So today we will be testing out the KISS rechargeable nail file it's the power file deluxe and this big box you get 15 pieces and in those pieces you get a cone shaped file a detail comb pointed detail file a fine grit barrel emery disc a polishing disc a small medium grit disc and a clinique or no sorry my bad can't read a large coarse grit disc so you get quite a bit in this and again it is rechargeable so, and also you get a cute push I believe that is so that's the box so let's go ahead and open this up okay. so I hear a little bit of rattling so I don't know if everything is packaged correctly but So, my favorite foam, I can't stand foam, it gets everywhere. So, here is this guy. Plastic. We'll just toss that aside. So, here it is. Yep, definitely things rattling. But here is the filing system. Uh, it's a nice hard plastic case. Um, very sturdy. I don't know. Oh, wow, everything is just falling out. Just rolling out. Well, let me just see how it works. Let me open this thing up. Let me see if I can open it. So. so. Here is the filing system. Opened up. There's, yeah, it's. I mean, it looks, you know, semi-professional. Obviously, it's not going to be professional grade. Um, this is something that you can use at home if you wanted to do your, if you do your own nails or anything. So, I'm not, my hopes are not going to be really high, but, you know, I just hope it works for the, you know, the little details. I mean, the people at the nail salon did really do my nails really well. So, um... I just want to take the layer off, file it down, make it even. So let's see if this thing works. Um, so here is the device. Um, again, no batteries, rechargeable. So hopefully it actually, oh, it works. It's not that loud. I don't know if you can hear it, but not that loud which is a plus, you get in here, you also get a power cord. Looks like, looks like a headphone jack. But, so I think you just plug it into this piece. Here is the cuticle pusher. Let's see if it actually works. Oh, wow, that really does. So, let's take a look at the box. Threw it away. So, this little guy is the polishing disc. This one is the emery disc. And then this little one is a fine, fine grit barrel. I don't know if you can tell. Focus, please. Focus, focus, focus. Yep, that's the fine grit. And then next is the detail comb. And that one looks like this. See, I can see my monitor I'm trying to focus. Put my hand up. 
Sorry about my bruised nail. I was at work and I smashed it into something. And blood got underneath the nail. So next is the medium grit barrel file. That one looks like this. You know, same kind of, I mean, it feels the same as the detail comb. Cone. Here is the cone shaped file. That one looks like this. And then next is the next is the pointed detail file. A little bit sharp. Just trying to focus. Looks like that. That one's a little bit rough. And then this one feels a little bit softer and this is the precision tool. It's a very small one. And I don't know what these discs are. I've never seen them before or I've never seen them ever used. But these ones, I believe are the same. Yes, or no, they're kind of different. Here is the, okay. So here is the small, the small coarse grit disc. You can see that. Let me set that one down. Looks like that. And then here is the small medium grit disc. That one looks like this. This is the large coarse grip disc. And then this is the large medium grit disc. Let's see if it will focus. I guess not so but yeah that's that. Let's just go in with a detail comb. Because I'll be just need little fine details. That's all I need. So, so again, you I mean it's not. I mean, silent, but you it's it's pretty quiet. I thought it was gonna sound like a drill, literally a drill, but um, obviously it's not. But that's this thing. You can see it's rotating. But there is. Also two speeds on this, um, so there's a slower speed and a medium and a higher speed. And there is a different, I can hear a different. But yeah, let's just gonna go, let's go ahead and go in. It definitely feels not, oh does not feel like the salon that is you know the salon this one has more of a like vibrating sensation on your nails um, you can definitely feel it at the salon there wasn't really that much that I felt but this one yes I am feeling quite a bit of vibration on my nail so I don't know if it's gonna happen I just don't like it Well, let's try one of the metal ones. I'm going to be taking the small, I'm going, to take, I'm going to take the precision tool. And that one is this one. Something small. Oh, wow, that's even louder than the cone barrel one. 
I don't know if you can hear it, but it sounds like it's rattling. I don't, I don't know. Let's see how it feels on the nail. Okay. It definitely feels like, I don't know. It feels, again, there's a lot of vibration. At the salon, there wasn't as much vibration. I know I'm comparing everything to the salon, but and I shouldn't. But if this one's not doing too much either. I know. Sorry, I'm ruining your work, but it's fine. Let's see if there's something more coarse. This one feels like more. This one is the pointed detail file. So that one is this one. Try this video out. So this one definitely took some layering off. Um, now it is, I mean, I can see a little bit uneven to the nail, so let's go ahead and go with the whole nail. Okay, so this is the nail. Let's see if we can get some So this file is actually really good for taking things off. I know it's a detail, but let's try out the barrel that actually is meant for taking layers off, which is a cone-shaped file. Oh, I don't know if I like that. Okay. It's definitely louder. I feel like they just get louder and louder and louder as I go. So, all right, let's try it. Don't like, I don't like the feeling of this one because if you look at the head, it's like, when it's going, it's like, it's like shaking back and forth and it's like hitting my nail and it's putting pressure on each side. So I'm not a fan of that. So one thing I'm noticing with the this one is it's not really taking anything off. There's not as much dust as the pointed file that I used just before this one. Um, let's just go ahead and buff this out. I think I just ruined my nail. So that's awesome. So I am going to use my nail file and my buffer to buff this thing out and then I will get back with you guys on my final thoughts. All right, guys, I am back and I just fixed all my nails. I mean, it has as best as I can, but honestly, this is a really good product to use at home. Um, it's very affordable. You can pick it up at any drugstore. Um, again, it's a really I enjoyed using it. I enjoyed unboxing it and seeing what's inside. Uh, it's pretty handy. I mean, it's portable. I love the fact that it is rechargeable, so it doesn't need any batteries. Um, but maybe one day I will go ahead and pick up the other one that does run on battery and then give that a go. And I can do a comparison on the two to see if you guys See which actually see which one I like better. Honestly, I feel like I would like the rechargeable one because I hate going out and buying batteries and a lot of products these days don't even carry batteries. Um, so yeah, definitely leave a comment down below if you want to see me test out the other KISS filing system. Uh, so Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys click the red button down below to subscribe. I will also be including my Twitter, my Instagram, and Snapchat for you guys to follow me on there. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks.